out. Okay, I'm ready. I think. Ah, well, controllers on Tingle. Are you using your controller? I'm seeing. I get something right and wrong with my controller. It says local co ops only supported when using controller. Uh, probably have to restart this server. Oh, server timed out. Player left. Said <laughs> server went out. Might have to invite me again. Uh, or join. Let me see, join a friend's game. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I think I see you. Alright, my controller's working. Oh yeah, that works. Forget about this. Yeah. They're talking to me. Alright. Ah, but I see we've suffered another orc landing. And judging by the relative ease with which it was dispatched, I can only come to one conclusion. Dos! Source hunters have arrived in Sisi. You're as well as a glass of <laughs> cooled milk on a hot day, my friend. That is my medieval I'm accent that you'll service. hear randomly. It dreaming. was I who requested your presence in this troubled city. So you were, and so you weren't. Behold, there we are. Meet my other half, Hunter. Ha <laughs> ha! No need to look so flabbergasted. I may be a wizard rife with tricks and guile, but I assure you, my plea is an earnest one. Flabbergasted. So, no now cat. that the cat is out of the bag, I know. let us turn Are you to gonna, the I can talk to animals, so it's like, oh, I'm used to you. It's like, oh no, you turn into a human. It's, it's very hard uncommon. to put my finger on it, but I can feel in my very whiskers that sorcery was at play. Visit the scene of the crime, and I'd bet sardines for salad you'll say the same. Captain sardines Orison, for salad? The local commander of the Legion insists I'm seeing ghosts. I insist he's blind to all but the undead. Jake was murdered in a downstairs room of the King Crab Inn, up in Sisiel proper. The Legion keeps it under lock and key, though, so you'll need Aureus's permission, should you want to have a peek. So there are. Or rather, there is. Popular opinion has it his wife did the deed. But to be frank, I have... She seems a likely candidate, to be sure, but that would make her a sorceress. Esmeralda knows how to charm, yes, but I just don't see her magic extend beyond a frolicsome look and wink. Still, don't simply take my word for it, Hunter. It may be well worth your while to cross-examine her yourself. The Legion has her under guard in her shop near the town square. That's where you'll find poor Jake's widow. A human, you say? Truly? But that would be like a kitten leading a wolf pack. And yet, I have heard rumors about a sect of sorts, a shadowy set of worshippers that associate even with orcs. Some say they're sorcerers, but people will say that about anyone who behaves a bit... I don't quite know what to make of this news, but thank you for informing me. It'd be foolish to dismiss such a curious event out of hand. Ah... The undead. They've been clawing their way out of the ground for two years now. And for two years, the stalemate between them and the living has been dragging on at a weary pace indeed. 
The Legion did a good job keeping them at bay, but I think it's fair to say that without my magic-infused ballastay, they'd have gotten the better of us. Someone is responsible for the outbreak. Necromancers are at work, but who are they and where do they hide? <coughs> Alas, that searching for them is like searching for a single louse in a lion's mane. Unfortunately, that is absolutely correct. The Orc Siege is yet another hairball stuck in this city's already <laughs> choking throat. We've cordoned off the western beach where most Orc activity has been reported. For the nine lives of me, I can't seem to figure what they're doing here. There's nothing of interest along the waterfront, except for a set of caves with an unfavorable reputation. Maybe they're after some pirate's treasure, the fools. <laughs> Oh, but that's not a trick. It's a such magic is a gift, Hunter. To tread upon the realm of instinct. Even articulate speech, perhaps humanity's greatest asset, cannot give expression to something so inextricably innate. To be out in the night, to stalk on silent paws and hunt with only the moon as your witness, but of course, it's handy to speak in more than meows. And I couldn't brew potions or make machines without opposable... I'm glad we've met Source Hunter. And I'm certain we have a lot more to talk about. Once you're there, just take the stairs. But do pay a visit to Aureus first. He may bark like a beagle with its tail stuck in the door, but you won't get very far in your investigation without speaking to the de facto leader. And with that, I bid you adieu, Hunter. Adieu and good luck. Sects are right. dead. Orcs. Looks like we have our work cut out for us. At least we won't be bored. How about we go see that Aureus chap Arhu mentioned? <clears throat> you have a. You have the scroll of uh, water, a rain. Your inventory by any chance? Uh. Darn it. Give me a second. Kind of forgot how. Oh, okay. Here it is. Can you cast it over here on this. On scroll this, uh, of what? Yes, yeah, scroll of rain. Scroll of rain? Uh, okay, hold on. The We're gonna need more than a few buckets to save her. You got it. What happened? I'll send it to you. All right. Should be in your inventory. Sorry. I'll use it right here. Oh, you already talked to him? Uh, oh, I don't even know if you have anything important to say. That was some fast acting there. Many thanks on behalf of all us seamen. <laughs> Madness. <laughs> yeah, I know. Kind of remind me of the Elder Scrolls Oblivion. That none yeah. of them dare to come close to the Tide Splitter. Tide Splitter. I don't Beacon know. Butter with almost all characters use a trait icon in the dialogue. Start buttering. No, he didn't. He drove it straight to the barber bank. Those orcs must be out of their barbarous mind. I'll tell you, the only time I'd consider waging a suicide campaign. Name's Conrad. 
cargo trader, sea captain, an expert in all things nautical. Folks across Andervale know to give old Conrad a hollow when it comes to rare imports. Oh wow, this guy has a shit ton of wands. Yeah, there's a lot of people you can talk to that don't uh, actually give you much information. You can talk to whoever you want. Yeah, cause it'll it'll bring up that ear icon. Uh, All right. You know. You go just explore a bit. There should be a bunch of side quests that you can talk to by getting a. Uh, just talking to the people. We share everything, like all the quests and info. Save stuff. that sheep all by your lonesome. Quite a feat. If I had the magic touch about me, I'd have lent you my hand too. Most of it's bullshit, though. What do you have to say? Are mm. irrelevant. I thought the old girl's fate was sealed when the orc shaman set his fiery gaze on her sins. Right. But you managed to rescue her from a watery grave. Closest thing to a miracle I've ever seen. <laughs> I mean, see. Yeah. Accidentally. What was that? Oh, waypoint. Uh, warehouse gig. Harbor warehouse. Uh. Okay. I tell ya. This gig sure beats getting my toes bitten off by zombies out in the field. <laughs> we warehouse guards don't have to do much apart from stroll the perimeter of you to land, of course. Every now and again, some friendly folks, like yourself, will wander through here. And nothing beats a pleasant conversation. Though my comrade Horatius has quite different opinions on that. Have you talked to him? <laughs> I think every man, woman and child who steps foot in this place wants to rob it blind. <laughs> if I so much as greet a townsperson with a... That sounds like you. Instead of you. Take no purpose. He's talking yep. frothing on and on about godly duty and security breaches. I got to make my money. This this <laughs> is quite the scandal, no? I myself suspect his wife, Esmeralda. Then again, and you didn't hear this from me, he's going through quite the nasty divorce himself. And there's his children to consider. But I imagine his youngest, Kimberly, won't mind, never did get on well with her mother ever since the incident. Oh, Wait, it's an it. unparalleled pleasure having a fresh ear around here. I don't know. We just left it at that. Oh, everything's marked right. Okay, so that means stealing. Mm-hmm. Oops, I did not mean to actually click that. <laughs> I'll try to see if I can see what was inside without actually taking. But I guess not. It'll automatically... Uh, what is oh, that? Uh, Magical lock, are you? No idea what that is. Yeah, it's a magical lock, I think. Right here in this door. Sneaky fell. Oh yeah, sneaky. Oops, wrong one. Yeah, oh, after can, you can't sneak in here because all the guards. No, you can. You just can't let them see you. Torch use. Turn off the torches so they can't see you. Oh. Oh, I can't reach it. I really wanted to get behind this door. I want to see what's back there. Never bring that back there, and I think about it. I like having to kill him. Oh, over here, over here, where I turned this torch off. What happened? I was sneaking. Oh. As you can see where the lighted area is, if you get lighted up, it'll automatically... Oh, yeah. uh, okay. Get. One die, you'll show them all. I get... I wonder... can't get through that... torch. I did not mean to click on that door, holy shit. And, well, I did, but I didn't realize it was locked. Action. One die, Moira. One die, you'll show them all. 
Okay. Oh, now it's dark. Well, at least for me. Let's see. You can do it, just don't get excited. Because this guy over here is looking that way. You see uh, way? Well, well, go to the other side and talk to him. See if it turns. It should. Oh, I'm in. <laughs> nice. Oh, I need to close the door so they can't see me. Unless you could come in and they don't should see you. This is a storing house. They must have had a lot of stuff in here. Are you coming? Or yeah, I'm just waiting. Oh but <laughs> alright, so I'm gonna be seen walking in. Alright. Uh I have I saved it right before you started doing this. Oh I didn't even see that torch up there in the wall. Uh, oh crap. You're still sneak you didn't have Yeah, oh uh, yeah, I was sneaking. But now. Or right, get in here so we could get them one at a time at the door. Oh right. still my turn. Okay. I get right here. Uh, how do you end the turn? Uh, it should say end turn. Um, I, don't, I don't know how to deal with the controller. Crap. Uh, so it's just a button that is right next on the, the toolbar and says end turn. Oh, it's B. Okay. Now it's your turn. <laughs> the controller got off. It's not working. Hold on. No, hold on. Give me one second. Um, somebody messaged me. Let me a message him. Oh, okay. They were saying, what are you doing playing Divinity? <laughs> I'm going to say, I'm with Brygar. No, uh, Zeph was like, "Hey, man, TS just got just cut out." I was like, "No, it hasn't." I was like, I'm in here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see. I might fall back in here then. You're saying? Oh, I didn't realize I'm stuck to level up now. Am I true? Oh, I did not let my true. Wonder how powerful these guys are. They're going to kill us. <laughs> Especially that, that sword wielding. Let's see. Damn, didn't do nothing. Hardly anything. Oops. Oh, he's opportunity attack. Killed us. <laughs> A trifle, my dear. Yes, yeah. All right, so this. Oh, what? Are <laughs> you reloaded? Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna die right there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I loaded. I saved it in here. Oh, that's good. We don't have to do too much. Then. Talk to. Oh, hold on. Let me get this guy more this way.
If you can, close the door behind you and just loot everything in there for yourself. Alright. I mean, alright, you're in. Alright, cool. You make me a thief. <laughs> you make me a thief. <laughs> so much monies. I still got this guy's attention. You just have to worry about the one that's patrolling, and then you should be good to go. Yeah, the door is closed, so he can't see. If it's Trevor, if it's Richard you're seeking, all you need, all you need is a friend guarding. The treasure room. How can I befriend this man? You. Whoa. What's Run over here? Gage, and I'll handle this threat for all our sakes. Oh, that's that. One so. die, Moira. One die, you'll show him all. This door is locked. He might have the key. I get. I can't see. Let me see if I could get this. Uh, Ura and love dot log. Oh, I came in late. What is that? Oh, that's a female what? Orc? Yeah. With the tail? That's it's mm -hmm. a orc. Yes, I know, it's weird. Mm -hmm. Enough of that. I know how dangerous an orc can be. But this one has been reformed. Anyone can see that she's completely docile. But my prejudiced friend here still wants to kill her. Uh oh. My Ooh. friend here and I were patrolling outside the city walls. When who did I see creeping along the shore? But this lovely orcish lady. That's lovely. For a brief second, as, well, as long as eternity, we locked eyes. That's fucking romantic. Perhaps confused by the butterflies in her stomach, she sprang up and began running, claws bared towards Marius. Fortunately for him, I had the presence of mind to ignore my sword and instead adroitly fling my pouch of trinkets towards her. A vial of love potion shattered over her head, and when she turned to face me, she became instantly enamoured. I'm sure she must have been compelled to join the Orcish army <laughs> under some kind of duress. A lady with such a sweetly savage mouth <coughs> would never willingly join up with those vicious marauders. Ha! I can assure you there wasn't a hint of sweetness in those murderous eyes when she lunged at my throat. She may be confined here for now, but who's telling when she'll escape and who she'll rip to shreds? Ah. I've always had an amateur interest in all things alchemical. When I read in an esteemed periodical from the Wizards of Youthful Gore about an amazing opportunity that could change my life, I had to act fast or lose a cent away for the world-famous love potion, available for a limited time only, and it has worked exactly as promised. You see what a fool my friend has been, spending all his cash on snake oil, and I'm bringing John a Gunnery. temporarily tranquilized monster <laughs> into our midst. That's what, what I was kind thinking. Of monster would lie in a published that's how, that's how you know Sean Connery's acting sure career with his shit. The will be He's not having to do voiceover work for video games. <laughs> <laughs> tell me Arse. about yourself. Let me tell you mm -hmm. what I think. I'll take my leave. Maybe before the great orc raid we had time to indulge Ninius's idiotic obsessions. But now we're needed at our posts. I can hardly believe I've been After this conversation, don't forget to level up, by the way. You have to be running them through. Yeah. 
I was going to do that. Excuse my friend's violent outbursts. He hasn't enjoyed a woman's touch in quite some time now. Your woman's Her. touch is less of a loving caress and more of a claw shanked brutally through the throat. I'll take my chances as a bachelor, you see? He'd believe it was noon at midnight if he read it on a printed pamphlet. Please tell me you can reason with him, or ditch reason and use your sword to shave him from his murderous d <laughs> Let her live. If that potion were truly worthless, <laughs> it wouldn't have been able to charm her in the first place. In this dose, it's fucking state, true love she may right prove there. to be a source of valuable that information. That is true love. You're right. The information she provides could well turn the tides here in Sicil. Bravo! I trust not only the potion, but my scaly sweetheart in and of herself. You're going to regret this. We're all <laughs> going to regret this. Most likely. I want to see them get murdered, to be honest, by the Too bad bird. indeed. Not even a skeptic like you can deny that she loves me. An orc in love. <gasps> ha! When this little charm fades, she'll liberate the flesh Oh, there's nothing else. Yeah, I'm leveling up right now. I'm just looking at my inventory. Alrighty. Let's Let's go up the stairs and continue on. Still thinking about exploring well, the, the, the beach? The actual You're town's free up to go. Stairs. Though we legionnaires are under strict orders like never that. to abandon our posts, so we won't be able to back you up. You can see security's tighter than ever around here since that surprise attack the orcs bit on a fortnight ago. They did enough damage to shake up Ahu and Captain Aurea something fierce. We can only hope to hold back the undead and these left field orc attacks long enough for reinforcements to arrive. I don't think you're quite ready to head out into the wilds to me. Also, a party of one or two runs the risk of being outflanked and outnumbered. I'd bring some backup if I were you. Of course, the choice is yours, but are you sure you want to venture out? <clears throat> Thank you for heeding my words of warning. Oh, can you get companions? One for you, one for me, or...? Yep. Okay, cool. So I was talking to that guard over here that has the gate closed. Yeah. Saying something about two of us is not enough. Fish ring. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Alright, that works. Got it? Yeah, I was leveling right. up. I was debating on some, some stuff. Man, I hope the Vanity 2 has a, some kind of run feature. Cause it's kind of slow. Yeah. Like, dang it, hustle, hustle, hustle. I don't think this game's that big though. Like, the map. <clears throat> it's like very condensed, since it's a lot of to do. Revisit. As things change with progress. Oh, wait, there's a. Oh, you gotta go outside to get through here. That chest over here. You can't jump. No. Oh well. Yeah, I'm not sure how you would get that. I guess it has to come to that way. Probably teleportation or something. You don't have that. Is there a spell for that? Oh no, there's a... There's a trapdoor right next to it. So... You just have to find where that other trapdoor goes. Oh, I see. Okay. I only saw the chests. I didn't pay attention to the other, to the rest. I wouldn't venture too Murder far out of town walls. if I were you. Murder within the walls, undead. Pointless information. Oh, Press what to open your map. Important characters will mark the destination. Okay. I got the tutorial. Oh, hey, wow! They changed the uh, <clears throat> they changed the layout of the building. What? What more? More graphically better? No, just like a little bit of the layout of the. Oh, the layout! The layout! I right. spotted something interesting. Give milk. I give wool. Yeah. 
What happens if I wet the sheep? Oh, oh wait, tombstone. Uh, hold on. The no, earth here. What? Would be an insult to the dead. Wait, what happened? Oh fuck. <clears throat> ah, I don't know what happened. I didn't even read, so I don't know what to answer. You can't insult yes. what's not alive to be offended. I say we dig. Oh, you were going to dig. Yeah. And a disgrace to whomever is maintaining this gravesite too. Damn it! I did not realize it was something like that. <laughs> you didn't dig anyway. Digging oh, you're in. digging. All that digging and there's nothing here. <laughs> what a waste. <laughs> Damn. So low. Yeah. Oh yeah, no, I didn't realize what I was thinking. I would have totally clicked, yeah, let's dig it up. <laughs> <laughs> In the wasteland, I had to slaughter a whole village because I dug up too many graves. He got pissed off. <laughs> you should have done it, Snake Mo. Yeah. Oh, that was, that was great though, because they were all just like villagers, like barely any. Wait, secure guns. lockbox. What is that? Lucky find! Whoa, got me a key. Oh, nice. Let's see. We could probably open this door. What? Wait, action. Pick lock, attack, open. What was that leak? What was that key for? Let me see. Inventory. Scrolls. Secure lockbox key. That's what the key is. It's for a chest or something. Let's see if I can find that chest. Maybe it's for that chest over there. Oh wait. This... Oh, it's probably for the chest inside of this house. Because that's where I got the key from. It's Evelyn's house. Evelyn. Door is strong. My arrow's not gonna do it. What? Watch the undead quiver in their moldy boots. Burrow, indeed. I'll sooner meet a cat wizard than see that merchant repaid. Come now, I'll be good for it. I swear. Solution to the so what do you think? Should I snag a fish? Everyone needs a hand now and then. Take the fish and none but us will be the wiser. Sure, everyone needs a hand, but who are we to offer the merchant's hand without his consent? He should leave the fish be. <laughs> Fresh habit, moving for fire. Any come on, Whether the merchant loses a fish or this man goes hungry, someone will suffer in this equation. We might as well help the man in the most dire need. <laughs> that fish simply isn't ours to give. We can't offer it up as though we had the right to do so. Ah! Alright. Okay, which one is me? I'm on the left side now. Yeah. Alright. No, you're on the right. Oh, what? No. <laughs> come on. Come back. Come back. What? Damn it. 
need it. I really need to put it. You put it into intimidation. I'm gonna be a rude guy in this game. <laughs> Dig. You have to increase your intelligence or your reason to keep my character in check. It's gonna be like almost chaotic evil, or it's gonna be chaotic, um, chaotic good. I guess it's the best. It's, oh shit. <laughs> Chaotic good, chaotic neutral. Uh, probably chaotic neutral. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> How are you winning? Luck! Yeah. Oh no! This is it right here. Oh no, oh no. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Now we'll do as I say. That's the spirit! Or should I say. The soul. Jeez. I mean, I'm an honest thief. Even if I go hungry, I wouldn't steal. I would beg, though. For alms. Oh, you're still tugging? I'm surprised his pantaloons haven't caught fire yet, the damned liar. <laughs> <laughs> Simply shocking the way he so blatantly lies. <laughs> Whoa, you betrayed him! <laughs> Damn. Come along quietly. You did the crime, sir, and the sentence is yours alone. Oh, that's true. You're a bad man. I have no choice. <clears throat> you. <laughs> yeah. I just wanted chaos to occur. Whatever happened. I thought sausages were supposed to help the people. Man. I guess that's. I guess that's chaotic. Good. They didn't want him to steal. Like stealing's yeah. bad. Yeah. But the fact that he stole. You're. Yeah, you're. And you're and more. Them into. <laughs> you're. You're neutral. Chaotic neutral. You do good and bad at the same time. No, that's what that is. Alright. Technically. Oh, she... <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're, she you're told you. Archer, right? Huh? You yeah, you Archer. Archer. If you wanna, if you want some bows and stuff, any of the arrows. Oh, for what? So she'll sell you stuff. Tomatoes. We don't, we don't get like uh like a keep or our base of our operations. No. Oh. No. 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 Everything is. Everything's always on you, essentially. Okay, so it's all, always on the move on. Yeah. Uh, you can kind of make a base. Um, like there'll be certain chests in the inn. That oh. the NPCs won't ever touch, you know, that you can just store shit in there. Oh, okay. Like, this, this whole city is kind of like our main base, it's like the safe zone. It's the central place, though. Yeah, it's like our central hub. So we'll be coming up back here most often. Yeah, and we can teleport back here whenever we want since we've unlocked the teleporter. Oh, okay. Cool. And later on, I think we will get an, uh, uh, an ability to teleport back here whenever we want. Oh, okay. I will say the pet ability, pet pal ability is really shitty and absolutely worthless. Hey, Quite did you just learn a recipe how to use stun arrows? Uh, I don't know. <clears throat> it just popped up in the middle of my screen. It's like, you just learned a recipe. But oh, I was, I was crafting. I craft, uh, I combine the items. Oh, I got you. I guess it gave me the recipe. Where do you repair your... Um... Almost any merchant can do it, really. When you talk to them, uh, it's at the bottom of the... Whenever you start uh, trading with them, yeah. it's at the bottom of the screen. There's a little hammer. If you click that, it'll say repair. And you can just click on your own items. Like, oh, once you click okay. that. Yeah. Alright. I'm already here. Alright. Um... 
All right, this guy's been talking to me about pretty much this whole time. He's just been convincing me, trying to convince me to join his organization. I've been like saying yes and no to certain things. What kind uh, of organization? There, he's a he wants to, us to join his group. It's called the Fabulous Five. Uh, you might be able to scroll all the way up on the conversation, but oh, uh, okay. Go ahead, uh, text, and I right. read this. All right, I'm ready whenever you are. No rush. All right, you already text. Yeah, I just that was just a quick response I needed to get. Oh. Really? It reaches does does not interest you? <laughs> I was curious to see what he was gonna say. Oh, okay, I get you now. <coughs> I think I know what you're thinking. Yeah. So you're you're trying to extract information from him. Yeah. Sort of. Yeah. Alright, so you caught up? Uh, yeah, kind of. Oh, hold on, I got two more. Uh, okay. Uh, go ahead. I kind of got. Oh, the fabulous five. How I enjoy simply saying the words that describe the most illustrious and celebrated adventurers guild in Rivalon. Our mission: to better the world. Our mantra: to better ourselves as we do so. To realize our dreams and cleanse our soul. You'd like nothing more than to enlist, wouldn't you? Of course you would. And you can. Of course, if you still have questions, I shall answer them to the best of my abilities. But if not, how about we get started? What a gem of a question. Straight as an arrow. Sharp as a switchblade. Most don't like the way you talk. <laughs> yeah, no. Now then, to join the Fabulous Five is to join a fellowship, to join a fraternity, a sorority, a community. The title of Knight is bestowed upon you the moment you sign our waiver, and so it all begins. I shall be the one to give you your first contracts, and once the job is done, I shall see to it you get your fair share of the reward. Mm. Of course, should you spread the word, should you propagate the gospel of the Fabulous Five and thereby draw new knights into our fellowship, <laughs> you will get a share of the reward from their contracts too. Isn't that wonderful? It's, it's kind of like those the uh, scam mails. The yeah, it's a pyramid scheme. It has, yeah, yeah. It? Pyramid but scheme. did I say fellowship? I mean family. For like a family, we support one another. Oh, Cheers. now he changed it. See each other through thick and thin. Partake in glory and defeat. He's trying so hard to Work sell whatever on. he's selling. Fulfill contracts. Enlist new knights, and swiftly shall you rise through the ranks. You will better yourself. You will better Rivalon. You will make the stars shine all the brighter. And you'll get fabulously wealthy in the process. What's not to like? Hmm. If only we could kill him and take over it. Curious. Curious. Of course, of course, of course. All you need to do is sign this waiver. Right, that's and right. just like that, snap! You're part of the family. All I need is your lovely little autograph. A fabulous five. I'd rather join us. Is there a thief skill in this game? Do you know? I actually don't know. Well, they're kind of. Hmm. This fabulous five business sounds too good to <laughs> yeah. be true. I'm going to pass. Agreed. You came on a little bit too strongly there, buddy. Oh, how frightfully disappointing. How illogical and short-sighted of you to deny the Fabulous Five. It is a crime against reason and humanity. 
opportunity knocks and you close the blinds. Now, Lackey's life is yours and by choice too. So long, fare thee well, though you won't. Uh, that sounds suspicious. Is he gonna send some kind of assassin to us? Wait, there's a king crab in. Oh, that's not his place, it's just the inn. I thought that was his place. No, this is an inn. This is where the murder took place. You think you can speak that way to Do you ever talk to that, uh, whatever guy? Arola? Which one? No, no, no. I haven't talked to him yet. Because you can't do any investigation. Sinkable Sam. At least that's what they call me around here. He used to be a ship's cat, but the clipper I was on sank when I was the only one to wrestle himself free from the waves. The people here were kind and took me in. Been the King Crab's foremost patron ever since. So I was. What friends I had. They drowned alongside the rats I used to hunt in the galley. And there I was. Oh, not that I have it bad here, mind you. I've milk and fish aplenty. Most folks will pet me kindly, and when one of the village girls holds me tight against her ample bosom, <laughs> I purr up a storm. But I do long for a companion of my own kind, and in that regard, there is no one like Maxine. <laughs> I am a duke, potato peasant. Maxine, the mayor's darling pet. So gentle, so... Fair a feline, the grace of her whiskers, the subtle palette of dyes in her sable coat. She she likes me, I know she does, but when I declare my love, she backs away. I don't know why, I have serenaded her and braved many a bucket of water for my <laughs> efforts, but for some reason she is not to be swayed. I am unsinkable sad. Oh, <laughs> hmm. So, how oh, I like my journal like to get the parchment. So you're just hanging around the inn, are you? Waiting for what exactly? Oh, oh you can steal paintings. Yeah, paintings are worth so much in this game. It's awesome. I usually almost always steal paintings. Uh, quick save. Alright, cool. Oh crap. My Dora, what's this? It sure does me good to set eyes on another of our order. From Academy West, aren't you? Give Captain more truce my regards next time you see him. Sounds Texan. Secrets. The likes of which I doubt you could even fathom. Who? Uh, Texan? Cowgirls? The way she talks? Oh my god. Country girl? Yeah. That's what I mean. You wouldn't. I trained up in Academy North, after all. We don't cross paths with you Westies all that often. But it's always a pleasure when we do. Medora's the name. Retired. Or so the Order keeps trying to tell me. But never out of commission. My hand to your cause and my sword at yours. Heavens, hornets! That's quite a story, comrade. And come to think of it, one that might concern you. See, I'm here on, well, let's call it a loan from a town to the north of here. Hunter's Edge by name. There's been an attack there, comrade. Orcs. Not your run of the mill savages either. But ones who've taken dark magic to new heights. What they want in Hunter's Edge, I can't say. 
but it's my responsibility to send them packing. Preferably with their horns in their suitcases and a knee-knocking fear of ever crossing paths with a sauce hunter again. I came south seeking the Legion's help, only to find it tied here in Sicil. They don't have a spare soldier to send northward, and even in my finest form, I can't clear the place of that many orcs without backup. By the skin of my teeth, comrade. The savages were rounding up villages when one of them activated a tripwire on our village wizard's property. Fortunately for me, that particular wizard has a penchant for things that go boom in the night. I managed to wrench free of my captor's grip and flee toward the forest. He pursued me for miles, but I'd lost him before I made it into the Sicil hinterlands. Well, comrade, I hadn't thought of it till you tapped my shoulder just now. But perhaps that's where you come in. I need a contingent I can trust if I'm to take back the town. And the way I see it, you could use reinforcements here in town. I've been scouting Sicil for some time now, and I believe I've sussed out sufficient intel to help solve the murder of the Counselor. All right. Now minds and swords in tandem, we'll make short work of the perpetrator. You, sir. You know the old expression, two's a tea party, three's an invasion. I know this place like the back of my hand by now, and the orcs up north will be short work for a trained up trio of sauce hunters. Careful now, your head's growing more swollen than saffron's, I dare say. A fantastic plan. With three sauce hunters working in tandem, we'll put an end to all the evils bent against this fair land. Another source hunter on the team will make us all the more formidable against this wicked magic. Welcome aboard, Medora. Oh, it's getting interesting. That's the spirit. Listen closely now. Do you hear it? That's the sound of every orc and sorcerer in a hundred mile radius shaking in his wee boots. So to concerns myself with such. There's four companions you can take with you, but you can only take two at a time. Right from the, the main characters, so you can always switch them out whenever you want, kind of like Fallout. Yeah. Oh. And each one, each character has their own unique side quest that you can do that you have to have them with you to, you know, essentially activate. All right. And uh, but know that you can't kill them. Uh, you can lose here? them forever, depending on, I believe, hunter, depending on it? certain situations. Well, uh, my day just became like the wizard that we can acquire. Stand still then, it's like if you a racist don't mind. towards demons is like the I best way to, to put it. <laughs> look and so anything demon Sicil. related or like supernatural, he fucking hates. If you, I think if you constantly take him with you and stuff like that, he'll either like just leave your party or try to attack and kill you. <clears throat> All right. Tall as an elf, strong as an orc, but your face quite classical, isn't it? Statuesque, some might say. Yes, smooth and sturdy as marble, yet fine as a chisel's edge. And my word, what passion burns from your eyes. Please forgive my being forward, but I... I dare say, can it be? You... Well, you're exactly the person I've been searching for. I am Anna, jewel in the crown that is the Fabulous Five. Oh. I've got a thousand throats and baked a thousand means? bread rolls. Stolen the crown jewels of the Queen of Arata. She's with the fabulous five. Helped her reach enlightenment. When the day comes that I die, the gods will evacuate the heavens to make space for my formidable collection of designer slippers. I contain multitudes, you see, and I am utterly replete. Except that, much to my dismay, I had as yet to find the companion to whom my heart so clearly calls. But then, Source Hunter, you wandered into this tavern, and I... Oh, I am most certain that that companion is you. Already refused to join? But darling, didn't you... Uh, how can we... Re refused? Oh, a plague on both our houses for now we may never link our destinies 
Away from me now, O oh perfect specimen. Torment me no further. But if you happen to meet more able-bodied, agile-minded adventurers, don't hesitate to uh, <clears throat> send them my way. A woman can only mourn for so long. My only one. Okay, that didn't work well. Tell me. Oh! <laughs>